What is up, people of Earth and beyond case on this here? Today, we have a brand new Madden Ultimate Team 15 gameplay commentary for you. Today, I am in a 10k coin game. There are going to be two coin games here. I haven't uploaded one in a while. Now, this is one of my very first coin games, guys. I kind of went out of order. Um, this is like my second batch of them that I did. Um, this is both against, both against a subscriber. Uh, he has a very high overall team for the time. He has a 90 overall. I have an 85 overall team. You will see by the players who I'm using. You can tell this is obviously an old gameplay. I'm using um, like Zach Mettenberger. Um... Martellus Bennett still, uh, Michael Irvin, people who are just simply not on my team. Also, Captain Stephen Tullock. These guys have been have long since gone. But, uh, yeah, I believe I recorded this on um, October 28th. So, yeah, guys, about two months ago. I apologize for that. But, um, yeah, this is going to be three videos in three days. What? Come on, you know you don't do that. I know, guys. I'm usually very, very sporadic on these uploads. Um, basically been once a week, but um, I'm like, all right, you know what? This winter break is coming. Um, let's just pump out some good videos for you guys. You guys have been loyal to me. Uh, you guys have um, allowed me to continue this, even though I'm not. Obviously, guys, I'm not this huge person, and don't believe me. I know I'm not. Um, I just think that I should at least, while I have this opportunity to have some free time, um, you know, give uh, p provide you guys with content. Uh, since I have been uh, lacking in that department lately, as I said before, it's basically been one video a week. So uh, you guys did get a pack opening. You guys got a, I believe, a. Um, you guys got to see my Super Bowl, and now I'm gonna hit you up with a coin game. The only thing I need to do now is a online uh, commentary. And I did see those uh, f those froze packs, freeze packs, whatever they were. Um, one gold player, one team of the week player, three badges, three silver players. You know what I'm talking about. Um. And oh yeah, also guys, Merry Christmas. I forgot to say, um, Merry Christmas, uh, Happy Holidays to everyone. Forgot to say that, but uh, for Christmas I did get forty dollars worth of PSN. So you know that bundles out there for like four thousand points. I have forty dollar PSN. Once PlayStation Network does get back online after this Lizard Squad BS blows over, same thing with Xbox One. Um, once that does sort itself out, I will get that uh, uh freeze bundle for you guys. Um. Maybe I can pull a cool gift as you see me get that nice interception with David Amerson. Um, maybe I can get a good gift. Uh, it does come with an elite player, guaranteed. Maybe I can get, I can get a good pull. But yeah, guys, so hopefully um, PSN does get back up soon. But you guys can look forward to that pack opening whenever I do choose to do it. I have not been buying a lot of packs, period, as Fred Belentnikov just drops a wide open pass. One of the reasons why he's not on the team anymore. But, um, you know, winter break is here, as I said. I got, I came into some money, uh, you know, with the PSN. So might as well buy some packs for you guys. Cool for me to do. Cool for you guys to watch. So that is that. Um, enough of this explaining stuff. Uh, let's get into the uh, gameplay. So we are up seven nothing with 20 seconds left left in the second quarter. Maybe I can get into field goal range. So I hit up Michael Irvin, which will get us there at the 35 yard line. I call timeout with three seconds, and with three th seconds left, I do get the field goal to go up. 10 to nothing, two possession lead. Now he does get the ball back at the start of the second half, as you guys see. But I do believe I can stop him. Uh, as he's running it with his guy, I believe, who is at 25, Giovanni Bernard he has. So he's looking right now, he's rolling outside the pocket, and he throws it, and right off my guy's head, I cannot get the pick. So third and 10, here we go, and I send my heat, but my guy just straight up misses the sack, and he finds um, John Mackey across the middle of the field. But I do send the same blitz, and it does get to him. So uh, second and 10 now, we cannot get the sack, but we did get the incomplete pass. He's running outside the pocket, and right there, we drop another pick. Come on, Kenny Vaccaro. You got to get... Uh, no, not Kenny Vaccaro. Um, TJ Ward, once again, showing how old this gameplay is. Tony Camardi coming in for the sack. Fourth and 16. Can we get a stop? He's just throwing up to his man. And David Amerson will get his second pick of the game. Um... Let's see how far we can return this. Obviously, not a lot, as you can see. Getting to the 41-yard line. But he will quit after that. Game's over. And uh, he does pay up. I believe that was a 10K coin game. Very small, but 10K is 10K. But that will bring us into our second game, guys. This second game is, I think, a Game of the Year nomination. Uh, this guy puts up a hell of a fight. I put up a hell of a fight. And we will see who will come out on top. It is the same guy. Almost kind of like a rematch thing. However, we did play this game um, uh, a little before, actually. I do believe this game became for 
came before the one you guys just saw. A little bit out of order, but bottom line is this is a great game. Same opponent. Uh, you will see different players on his team. Uh, you will notice that my players basically stay the same. But uh, yeah, this one is for 15k. Once again, not a huge sum. This was in the beginning. But um, I hope to play uh, higher coin games, guys. Uh, just a lot of people I play with, they don't really play coin games. I have like three people who can who will consistently play. But yeah, if you guys have PS4, I've gotten this question a lot. I do not have Xbox One. I do not have PS3 anymore. I do not have Xbox 360. I have PS4. If you guys do want to play me, um, just uh, my gamer tag is on my channel description. It says my gamer tag. Just hit me up. Ask for a coin game, and I will play you i record i record almost all of my games i do miss a few here and there if i just don't feel like recording but for the most part i will record it but um yeah just hit me up with the coin game guys gives me content you know maybe brings you guys some uh, fun if you guys are able to play me but yeah just uh hit me up guys i will accept i do accept almost all coin game uh, offers but let's get into this possible game of the year uh, I do have the, uh, no, I don't have the ball, what am I talking about, he has the ball still, as he's driving down the field on me with, I believe that is Doug Martin, uh, yeah, 22, and um, after a nice uh, gain, he does get, we do stuff him up, so second and 11 now, I'm using with the middle linebacker, just tosses it up to his guy, and we can't get the pick, but we do get the next, next back thing, next best thing we do swat it away then right there oh god user pick nice try kid it's not gonna work on us as we do get the user pick with steven tulloch to stop him and now we do have the ball running with levy on bell get eight yards run it with him again and get the first down first and 10 245 left in the second quarter running wide trail and i hit my guy but Zach Mettenberger overthrows him, and it is an incomplete pass. Second and ten now. Just some slants. Maybe we can get something open. And um, Jordy Nelson is open across the middle of the field as he takes that huge hit for the first down. Le'Veon Bell now on the stretch. Only gets one yard. Brings us to the two-minute warning. Uh, rolling outside the pocket with Zach Mettenberger. Nothing's open. And then I find VJax on the in route for a nice... 15 14 yard gain to the 47 then martellus bennett pass position to the inside getting into field goal range first and 10 i want to eat up this whole second quarter make sure he cannot answer back 55 seconds left i want to play my cards right in i almost throw a pick right there he does drop the pick i do get a little lucky there um now i'm looking and jordy nelson uh that's not jordy nelson vincent jackson on the reposition uh to a streak is open six yard line 25 seconds left Le'Veon Bell, only a two-yard gain, and then the next play, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh, what an awful, awful, awful read by me, he was open on the slant route, I wanted to position, uh, position to the left for some reason i threw it to the right behind him and cam chancellor takes it back for six right as i was gonna get a touchdown instead of me being up seven nothing he is up seven nothing what a turn of events i stop on my drive all the way down the field and i make a stupid stupid pass and he takes it back for six and i am now down with my back against the wall classic me always letting people back in the game you know what am i gonna do with myself but um just gotta shake it off let's get this w and let's uh try to do what we can as i get my tell spending again on the streak route getting to the 34 yard line so if push comes to shove i will take my field goal but obviously, I want this tie. V Vincent Jackson gets open on this slant again as the middle of the field clears up. Not a hit up Michael Irvin, who cannot make the catch. Uh, second and 10 now, wide trail. And um, Jared Cook is now in the game. Uh, 91 speed, guys. Third and four. Jordy Nelson open on the slant, converting it. M moving the chains. Do it again. And I almost threw another pick, but we just get it in. Uh, now it's on the one yard line, second and goal, try to run it in, and Darren McFadden takes it in himself, spelling Le'Veon Bell, and we do tie it up at 7-7 seven, seven, seven now, uh, 50 seconds left in the third quarter, uh, we could really use a stop and get the lead back, um, I believe I can stop his defense, but uh, <laughs> I'm just not confident right now as is, even though I did just come off this, the uh, touchdown. I'm still kind of demoralized after that awful, awful pass right before halftime. But third and nine now would be awesome if we could get him to a fourth down. He's looking, and I see 22 wide open. Doug Martin on the wheel route, wide open, just didn't have anyone there. As we can't even get the fumble back. 
But uh, that will move the chains for him. Nice read. Give to Doug Martin again. Doing a spin move. My guys can't even tackle him. Getting a nine yard gain. Second and one. Running right up the middle. Just untouched for a first down. 45 yards at the 45 yard line. Getting a huge run all the way to my own. Uh, what is that going to be? Like 39 yard. Almost in field goal range. And now that will bring him into field goal round, field goal range as Doug Martin does get it to a third and one. I mess up the user. Nice pass by him. And he is going out of bounds with a minute 40 seconds left in my territory. Basically able to win it. One first down should end it. A minute 30 left. Now I don't know why he's passing it. Right there we are able to swat it away. Third and nine. And I leave the slant open. And that should just about do it. He could knee it but he won't. And uh, he will get in for the touchdown guys. But he made that mistake. And I plan to take advantage of it. He could have just need the ball out, give me like 10 seconds to get a field goal, but now I have a minute and 20 seconds left to get a touchdown, which is easily doable, and right now I might just have to do that as I get Jordy Nelson on the out route, get some blocks, and Jordy Nelson is all by himself, making his way to the end zone, one guy to beat, and we that guy misses us, and we do get into the end zone, two die at 14-14, and this game is going down to the last second, a minute and four seconds left. He just needs a field goal. I could really use a stop, possibly force it into overtime, or maybe just get interception right here. Giving it to Doug Martin, who gets, uh, after the spin move, gets a nice uh, five-yard gain, but that won't really help. Um, the clock is still moving, and we left that wheel route wide open again, and we do tackle him out of bounds. 49 seconds left at the 45-yard line. We need to make something happen now as we swat it down. Um... Probably should have been a pick, but what are you going to do? Right there, and oh my gosh, user pick game, and... Oh my gosh, Madden. I'm dropping user picks today. Are you serious? And I do drop the user pick, and that will just about do it. He is in field goal range, guys. Just running the ball. One timeout left. 30 seconds left. 33-yard line. That should be game. As he throws it to Vernon Davis, we get it knocked out. 18 seconds left. What are you going to do? Uh but I am not out yet, guys, as we do get the user pick to save the game for us. Steven Tullock, second user pick of the game. You dodged a bullet kid once when I dropped that user pick, and now I got it back. One play left. Jordy Nelson, he's all by himself. One-on-one -on -one coverage. Can we get it? One-handed grab, and we will get the catch. Call the timeout. We will kick the field goal, and we will win 17 Four team final. We win the coin game. What a turn of events. We get the user pick with 18 seconds left. Hail Mary to Jordy Nelson. Spec catch, one handed catch. We kick the field goal and we win 17 14. And we win both coin games. And that will be it, guys. Game of the year. I have another great game coming out very, very soon. It's been Case Onus. Hope you guys enjoy your holiday break. And I will see you guys later.